All right, first stop is picking up the rental car. And yes, it is that small. Should be a fun eight hour drive to Zermatt. So, after driving for five hours from Luxembourg to get into Switzerland and paying 40 francs in tolls, we come up to another toll booth and are asked to pay another 30. We get into a pile up of cars and wonder what the heck's going on. <laughs> then we pull onto this car train or tram that I think is going to take us through the mountains. So here we are at the top of the Gornergrat Glacier Trail. I'm about to walk over and get get crazy over there on that ledge. So stay tuned. <sighs> okay. See that so after spot? a semi-treacherous walk, right I've made it there. over That's to my husband. kind of a secluded peak area over here. I'm gonna pause the camera and turn it around so you can see. pretty crazy. And if you look closely, you can see Allison way over there. Look at that, athlete. So what is going on here? Are we throwing a fit? About the hike being too long? <laughs> My feet are so swollen, I feel like a pregnant woman. Will you get up? It's just, I'm getting the blood out of my toes. Is that how that works? <laughs> oh. All right. Good. What does it taste like? A little funky. <laughs> After the first bite, Blake thought it tasted funky, so he tried it again. Here's his uh, second take on the fondue. It's <laughs> no for me, boss. <laughs> about halfway through our hike up to the world's largest pedestrian suspension bridge. And this steepness is about the, 
all the same throughout the entire hike. On top of our 10 mile hike yesterday. So, needless to say, our calves are dying. We've got about halfway to go, and we came these views. We're about halfway. Blake, how are we feeling? How are we feeling? He's ready to get the f off. Is what his words were. competitive game of putt-putt in the mountains up here. Oh, you got so lucky. You got so lucky. All right, we got Allison, hole two, loop-de-loop. -loop. Let's see what she's got. Oh, no. Oh, that's rough. Notice how Allison's ball is no longer on the playing field. She parred out with a two. Blake's ball is stuck in the corner over there. Also notice I did clear the tunnel on the first shot. And rolled back this way. Oh no. Oh, right in the same spot. All right, Babe Ruth, wrong sport. Hold on. She focuses in. Well, I have squandered a nine stroke lead, now down to a one stroke lead. We have two holes left. Three, wait, three holes left. Blake thinks for some reason he's going to get lucky here and get it in the first try. I'm not thinking so. Oh, rough life. After a long fought battle, Allison, 58, Blake, 63. I must admit, I lost. Here's our uh, takeoff spot. Way high up the mountains. Way high up. Taking off around 4,500 feet. 
above sea level, right at the top of the mountain. There we have our two pilots. Mark and Greg. Can we do this? Okay. Then we just wait good wind and we go. Well, we've safely landed back on the ground. Oh, would recommend, but feel a little sick. <laughs>